Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us with Andy Murray. If you have a question, please raise your virtual hand and we'll get right to it with Russell Fuller. Well done, Andy. I'm sure given the quality of the opponent and the heat and the slow court and the way you had to come from behind, was that one of the more satisfying results of the last year or so? Yeah, I mean, yeah, it was. I mean, <clears throat> wasn't easy out there today. Yeah, not not easy conditions, very hot. Uh, you know, court is incredibly slow. Um, balls after, you know, a couple of games are also extremely slow so it's yeah not 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 easy out there not easy to finish points uh you know not getting many many free points on your serve or anything like that so yeah it was um was was a good win and talk us through the underarm serve i can't ever remember seeing you do that before no i mean i've never done it on the tour before but you know the courts are the courts are so slow, and you know if you look since Wimbledon, you know obviously made some improvements to my serve and was getting lots of free points, and you know serving a lot of aces uh, in the matches that I played uh, recently, um, and yeah, obviously played for three hours today, and I, you know, I served three aces, you know, in a, in a long match, um, one of them being the the underarm serve, so. You know, if you if you look where he was standing at the beginning of the match to return the first serve in comparison to he changed that at the end of the first set. Uh, he started returning from further back, so it was even harder to get three points on the serve. And I thought, you know, if he's going to stand that far back and I'm getting no no love from the the court and the conditions, like why not try it and see if I can bring him forward a little bit again. Wasn't expecting, obviously, to get get an ace out of it, but um, yeah, he was so far back. He didn't didn't obviously react. Wasn't expecting it, and uh, yeah, I was thinking about using it, you know, at times and in, in the third set. But I was, you know, I was obviously up in the score, and you know, I was doing a little bit better, and you know, didn't feel like I needed to. But yeah, certainly when guys are standing where they are to return serve, now it's it's a smart play. All right, we'll go to Craig Gabriel. Andy, uh, you're saying obviously satisfying on, on uh, the way you played today with the, with the win. Firstly, what, how encouraging is it besides being satisfying um, the way you played? And the second part is um, if you're able to look ahead to, to playing Zverev um, in, in the next round. Yeah, I mean, obviously, you know, I'm happy. It was kind of like at the US Open, like my body did well today. Uh, you know, like I said, it was was hard conditions. It was very hot. And because of the the nature of the court here, you know, you're going to play some some long rallies and especially against a player like him. So, um, yeah, at, at times I played some really good tennis. You know, it wasn't wasn't my best match, and I can certainly still do things better. But I thought I competed well today, which was, um, you know, probably the most most pleasing part um, for me. But um, yeah, looking to towards the next match, obviously Zara is a top player. Um, you know, he's he's had a good uh, good summer post Wimbledon with the Olympics, and then. You know, great run at New York and played a tough match with Novak there. So, um, yeah, not not going to be easy for me. But, um, you know, I've played some some good matches against him in the past. <clears throat> um, and, yeah, we'll need to need to play really well. Does your winning record over him mean anything going into this match? Um, I don't know. I mean... Obviously, the the match that we played last year. I mean, I, you know, I'm not saying he was playing his best tennis uh, at that stage, but um, you know, he did, you know, make the final of the U.S. Open a couple of weeks later, and you know, I wasn't physically feeling particularly good and did not play particularly well and managed to to win. So from that perspective, like, I can gain confidence from that that, <clears throat> you know, if I play a really good match, I'll be right in there with with the shot. Um, 
he would certainly go into his yeah overwhelming favorite but um yeah if if, if i play a, a high level match i'll i'll be right in there all right thank you everybody